Hi, this is Roland. I want to tell you about a new book I just wrote. I'm real happy about it. It's called Contemporary Contemplation with Reflections on Miguel de Molinos. Miguel de Molinos was a mystic, a Christian mystic, who wrote about 300 years ago, and he is much beloved and appreciated. Miguel Molinos talks about contemplation. What is that? Well, nowadays you hear a lot about meditation. You hear people talk about mindfulness and meditation and so on and so forth. And you see magazines devoted to mindfulness and meditation and all that kind of stuff. But there's something missing. There's something missing. And what is missing? You want to know the truth? It's God who's missing. You got to find God. It was St. Augustine who said, love God and do what you will. So if you want things to work out in your life, there's one simple way for that to happen. You got to find God, get him involved. You got to find God. And a proper meditation, if you want to call it that, we could call it contemplation. We could call it contemplative prayer. Call it what you will, but it has to be simple and it has to be from God and it has to be to God from my lips to thy ear, or from thy lips to my ear. It's got to be very, very intimate and very personal. And there can't be the hand of man in it. There can't be anything weird or far out or esoteric or ritualistic or anything in it. It has to be pure. I'll give you a little story and it'll explain it all. A little parable for you right here. A little child came to his mommy and he had a handful of dandelions and the mommy took the dandelion she was very happy and then someone else said oh you have a bouquet of dandelions and the mom said from my husband a dozen red roses but from my little child a handful of dandelions will do so the meditation whatever you want to call it has got to be a handful of dandelions because it has love in it, it has innocence in it, it has simplicity in it, and God will appreciate those dandelions, and he will give you back something very, very wonderful. He will give you back his love, and he will shine his light upon your life, and your life will become beautiful. Now, these words are not just mere words, but you have to experience it. It's not enough just to read a book or listen to somebody or go to a seminar, or go to a retreat. It's not enough. You have to go in your room. What did Christ say? Go in your closet. He, he meant room. Go in your room, close the door. And then what did God say? God said, be still and know that I am God. And so therefore, in this new book, that's what I talk about. I talk about what Murlinos found. I talk about contemplation. I talk about how to do it. Remember, it has to be simple, how to do it. It's very beautiful. Now I want to read you something that Molino said, which I think is very nice. If I can find it here, yes, here it is. He's talking about the throne of quiet. When the soul finds God, the soul has found the throne of quiet. And he says, the valley is darkened with dark clouds, fierce tempests, thunder, lightning, and hailstones. But at the same time, the lofty mountain glitters by the bright beams of the sun in quietness and serenity, continuing clear like heaven, immovable and full of light. The same thing happens to the blessed soul. The valley of the part below is suffering tribulation, combats, darkness, desolations, torments, and suggestions. But at the same time, on the lofty mountain of the higher part of the soul, the true sun casts its beams. It inflames and enlightens it, and so it becomes clear, peaceable, resplendent, quiet, serene, since it is but an ocean of joy since it is but an ocean of joy. That's what the soul becomes when the soul finds God. So, I'd like you to get the book. You know it's at Amazon now. 
and I've set the price very low. It's only $298 or $295. And it's a very easy read in uh, the Kindle edition, please. Or you can get it from me, a PDF. If you want a PDF, just send me an email, roland at sheddingshackles.com, and say I'd like to have a PDF of the book. And then you can send a little donation. Go to the website, make a little donation of any amount, a buck or two, if that's what you want. And I'll send it to you. The book is called Contemporary Contemplation with Reflections on Miguel de Molinos.